Right guys, Gwen Lewis here, back with another match day vlog. Sunday, Premier League action, it's Manchester United versus Leicester City. And look, on the back of that comfortable 2-0 win against Pauk in midweek in the Europa League, I like to think we can go on and get another win today. Obviously both teams in the, the bottom half of the table. Liverpool seem to be running away with this, with this league, which doesn't really help matters. Uh, both us and Leicester do need the points, so it's going to be interesting to see what what happens today? I just, I really want uh, a good game and ultimately three points. Desperately need three points. Let's see what happens today. Right, Leicester City at home. What do we think is going to happen today? Yeah, uh, obviously on the back of uh, Pauk. Uh, yeah, they were Greek Super League champions, but didn't really... The fans really... turned up. Yeah, it was great, it was great support, but uh, in terms of a spectacle, first half wasn't great. Second half, you know, Ahmad took over, didn't he? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Ahmad, maybe a doubt today, I don't know. Foot injury, so there's, there's a chance he might not, not start or might be on the bench, mm -hmm. but other than that... Same situation with obviously the players coming back, got our players training. Miraculous, miraculously, Luke Shaw's back in training. Yes. Probably, probably because Tenar has gone. Huh. Uh, Malassia training, I believe. I think I don't know Who, who's Malassia. I don't know. Have you ever seen him play? Uh, Forget about some players, you know. So yeah, uh, Leicester. It's going to be a different Leicester that turned up uh, when we played him in the uh, Carabao. Yeah. Uh, I, Probably expect is Vardy injured? I don't know. Don't know. You'd expect him to play if he was fit. Yeah, but, definitely. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna be five two again, is it? Uh, Leicester struggling uh, down beneath us. They need, need the points. We need the points. Uh, we need to cap, you know capitalise on somebody's team slipping up above us. Uh, actually, yeah. we're a mile away from City, but City and Arsenal dropping points. Chelsea and Arsenal today, so we need. To, I think we can only go up a couple of places if we do get a win. Mm. But we need to keep chipping away. It's Rude's last game uh, in, in in temporary charge, so yeah, it's going to be a you know. A, a, I think the crowd are going to be up for it. Leicester will be up for it. So prediction wise, you, you got the last two predictions right. I don't know. It'd be tough today. I think. Don't know what what prediction. It's always um... yes. Yeah, it's, it's a tough one to predict, but I think we're, we're going to be up for it. So I'm going, I'm going again. Three 0 United. Three 0 Yeah. Well, again, I'm going two 0 Um, I think it's it's harder to predict clean sheets because I think you always have in your mind that it's, you know the away team's going to go to score, or I think it's it's much harder to think it's going to be a clean sheet. But I'm confident we can keep one. I, I think Leicester. Obviously, the, the, the yeah. I mean, Leicester are fighting for points, and, and you can never rule out a goal, can they, you? They against us, they so. don't tend to score many goals, Leicester, from what I've seen. So I'm hoping we can keep them at at burn. I mean, if, and if Vardy's out, then I don't really see where the goals are are coming from. So, but we, like I say, we have to get the job done. So mm. that's it. I'm going to go two 0 again. Two 0 three 0 Cheers. Thank you. 
Sorry, people. But this is Today's match we will show our support to the Royal British Legion on Remembrance Weekend. Before we observe a moment of reflection, the club would like to extend a special thanks to our representatives of the armed forces for their contribution to the day's remembrance activity. Lieutenant Commander Steve Cass, Royal Navy, Captain David Martin, the Army, Private Bill Martin, the Army, we ask you to join the players in observing a period of silence which will start on the referee's whistle shall not weary them nor the years condemn at the going down of the sun and in the morning we will remember them Job done, let's not mess around. What a flick from 
referee has indicated a minimum of two minutes of an interim. Saved by the legs of uh, Vestergaard. I mean, that's half time, 2 0. Um, top comprehensive performance, I'd say. Yeah, we've been comfortable. Last time, not really uh, given us any, any problems, to be fair, have we? Yeah, so, yeah, well taken goals. Amar's been pretty much the star man again, I think. Yeah. Rashford's been the passenger. Uh, we, play, we passed it around well against a, a very, very poor Leicester side. So 2 0 is comfortable, but you know, as much as we've played well, sometimes the final ball again. But you know, it, if you said it's 2 0 at our time, I'd take that all day. But yeah. I think he needs to consider his options in the second half if he wants to get the, the best out of the, of the side where Rashford is. He needs to come off because he, I don't know where he's playing half the time. Get Garnacho on, get some pace, get a few goals, hopefully. Substitution for United. Substitution for United, replacing number nine and Rasmus Hoyland. Hoyland off, Dirtsy off. United replacing number 18, Kosakura. The referee has indicated a minimum of six minutes of time. Time here, United three, less than nil. Top twenty performance, I think we played very well. First and the second half, Ahmad, another brilliant performance. I don't think anybody had a bad game today. Um, that's it, Roots' time here is, is over, um, at least in the managerial role, you could say. We didn't lose the game under him, I think we drew 2 1 against Chelsea. Won the, won the rest, Amrim will take charge tomorrow. Let's see where the, uh, the Amrim era can take us. So, in the meantime, I think it's international break now. Our next game ain't for another few weeks, so uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's bounce back. Come back after the international break and uh, continue this winning streak. Come on.